Bob the Spider Hunter here. It's fall time in Michigan, at least in West Michigan and all over the area. And uh, love the colors this year, it's been pretty cool. Like this uh, golden yellow tree here, nice colors. Uh, let's take you back though, I'm gonna leave this little cooler temperature area, take you back to St. John Virgin Islands where we're gonna go from the yellows to the beautiful aqua blue waters. Let's go back and see what we can find as far as the spiders are concerned at St. John, Virgin Islands. Come out with me. Weaver, I like to call the junkyard dog. Just a little guy at the tip of my finger here. From the other side, he's right at the tip of my finger here. He's not much to look at, but he's still a spider. Get some good camouflage built into his body. So there's the junkyard dog. <laughs> All right, let's see what else we can see.
following this little uh, creek, small river, whatever you want to call it. Uh, it's a downflow from the mountains that eventually empties out here into the bay. And uh, there's been some interesting critters along this route. Let's keep going. Along the water's edge here, I've found a spider, uh, orb weaver, small little guy. Um, I think it's, it may be one I like to call the junkyard dog, uh, like you've seen earlier. This guy's got a little bigger web, even though he's a little tiny spider. Let's see if we can get some closer shots. This is all the spider's junk. <laughs> Garbage. Haven't saw this, didn't see the spider yet. Uh, this little guy, right at the tip of my finger. We're looking at the back side of the spider. Now we're looking at the top side of the spider. He's turned around in his web. Nothing fancy in this little guy. And there he goes. A little bit bigger one right behind him here. He's in the center of his web. Let's see if we can get him to move for us. There he goes. A little orb weaver. Right tip of my finger. Now at the center of his web. And back into his little little recess area there he made. <laughs> Alright. Then uh, right above me here, I'm going to try to talk softly, is a young juvenile iguana. Um, this time of the day, 
as the sun starts to get warmer they come out of the tops of the trees and come down and wander around the ground for things to munch on so let me turn my camera up and you'll get a chance to take a little glimpse of this little juvenile iguana don't know if you see them yet they're they have some great camouflage with uh, the juveniles being in the lime green color. Let me zoom in for you. Do you see him yet? His tail's hanging down. Right in the center of your screen. There's his belly, his paws, and his head. He's just a little lineman up there today or chilling in the morning sunshine. Young juvenile iguana. They have about uh, 100 little tiny teeth. Very sharp. However, they are vegetarians, so you don't have to worry about them. Um, but if they get anxious with you around, get, you get too close, they may whip you with their tails, and that stings. <laughs> I always love the iguana. Of course, I love them at all. web action here and the spiders right in the center of the web but I'm not going out any further over these logs because they're over the water This is where this little creek ends. <laughs> 